what is up everybody welcome back to the channel um another youtube deposit man god bless youtube shot to youtube i do not take this shit for granted one bit like this right here is super super powerful you guys this um again man i'm humbled by it man i don't i don't i don't take this lightly because i just know how 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 much of an extra income okay now 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 keep that word in mind the word here the power keyword the 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 the, the quote unquote word i just mentioned was extra okay any extra income man is a blessing that's the way i look at it so many many of you have full time hustles whether you're building a full time business you're you have a full time job millions of you guys right now don't even have a full-time job anymore, right? Because of all the crap that's going on right now, April, 2020. So I'm, I'm, my heart goes out to every single one of you that are struggling for that next dollar right now. The shit is real, right? The struggle is real and, and shit has hit the fan depending on when you're watching this video and, and anything extra right now financially can go a long way. Right. And so I have just kind of had the foresight of, 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 and to tell you the truth, it wasn't even, I'm going to keep it real. When it comes to YouTube, it wasn't that I had a foresight, but I have always had a foresight in multiple streams of income. I always knew the power of residual income, passive income, being able to do something once and get paid for it over and over and over and over again. That form of, 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 of reoccurring income, I learned that 20, 21 years ago. I learned the power of that. 20, 21 years ago. And so today, where we're at now with social media, specifically YouTube, um, being able to create some type of extra income, being able to create some type of form of passive income on YouTube blows my mind. Now, is it an overnight thing? Hell no. Is anything an overnight thing? Hell no. Um, I don't care what you're investing in, man. Stocks, real estate, whatever. Any income vehicle out there that you can possibly build a residual income around is not an overnight thing. And so YouTube for me, for sure hasn't been an overnight thing. And it wasn't even my intention in the beginning to even make money from it. When I started my channel back in 2017, 20, 20 yeah, 2017, really, you can look at my channel, you can go to the very first video, I think it was 2017. When I started the channel, it wasn't to start a channel. I mean, shit, I'm going to keep it real. It wasn't because I was planning on being a YouTuber at all, like far from it. Um, in fact, today, I'm not even a YouTuber, like at all. Like that's not, not at all. Um, but when I started it in 2017, it was mainly to park my video content. It really, it, it, that's all it was. That's all it was. It was just the fact that I started getting comfortable with video and just simply pulling out my phone and doing selfie style video and at that time is when I started my social media agency. So I started getting clients. I stuck to one niche. I, still to this day, I'm building my agency. I, I, I focus on one niche. That's the real estate niche. And, and, and I chose, actually, I, didn't, I don't even think I chose that niche. I kind of fell into that niche just because of my previous background. I was a mortgage guy. So I was a lender. I was a loan originator. I was doing mortgages um, for, for, for six years prior to that year, which was 2016, 2017. So from 2010 to 2016, I was doing mortgages. So I was already in the industry, mortgages, real estate. I was already in the industry for many, many years, right? 2010 to 2016. So I kind of stumbled into helping real estate professionals with their social media marketing in 2016 into 2017 because I had this background in marketing that all started in 1999, but I had this background. I had this passion for the industry of real estate and, 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 and investing in things of that nature. So I'm like, man, let me see if I can bring my marketing, my mortgage. Let me see if I can bring all that into now helping real estate agents with their social media marketing. And let me see if I can leverage my knowledge and expertise with that. And that started in 2016, 2017. And as I started getting clients and as I started building my agency and, 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 and reaching out to people on social media and I kind of found my way, I found my niche, I found, I found somewhat success and, and what I called success back then and what I still call it to this day is the marketing side of it all. Being able to market, being able to reach out to someone and get them on the phone. So if you're in the client services business, 
leads for you to market and actually capture leads. That is a success. Like, cause not everyone can even capture leads. So for me back in 2016, 2017, I found my little way and I'm like, Hey man, I can, I, I started direct messaging, right? I started direct messaging people on social media and, 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 and getting appointments out of it. And then before you knew it, I got really good at it. Really, really good at it. 2017, 2018 into 2019. I got really, really good at getting people through the DM and, and, and scheduling an appointment to get them on the, on the phone. And it wasn't the phone. It was actually Zoom. So just like this, I, I, and still to this day, that's how I do all my presentations. Not one deal have I have when it comes to my agency, not one client, not one deal ha has came from me sending a direct message and asking for their phone number. Not one. And I've closed hundreds. You can go to my playlist um, on how I'm building my social media agency. In fact, I'll put that playlist in the description. Um, I have tons of videos, man, a year ago, two years ago, three years ago. I have a ton of videos of me just documenting. And, 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 and to this day, I've closed literally hundreds and hundreds of clients. Um, direct message, not asking for their phone number, getting them on Zoom, screen sharing like this, and doing business, right? So I have a ton of videos on that, you guys. But my point is, is that when I started this channel in 2017, it was simply on my cell phone doing ghetto ass videos. And still to this day, this video is ghetto. I mean, there ain't nothing to this damn video that I'm doing here today. No edit, no fancy, you know, intro, no freaking music behind the damn thing. Not, none of that crap. I don't even know how to do none of that crap, man. Um, but it all started on my ghetto ass cell phone doing simple videos and documenting what I was doing. Building an agency, closing clients, blah, blah, blah. Right. And in 2017, it was just to park my content. I could have took that same video and put it on Facebook. I could have put that same video on LinkedIn. I could have been like most of you bozos and just doing Instagram lives or now TikTok and all that crap. It's like, dude, I could have easily put my content there. But for some reason, I started putting these videos on YouTube. And that was in 2017. Random videos here and there, right? Sticking on one topic, online entrepreneurship, digital agency, social media marketing, and at that time, I started learning Facebook ads. So I was documenting that, right? And all it was was, was, was was that. It was documentation. It was documenting the fact that I was doing something, right? The fact that I was, I was in the trenches. And that's kind of what I, what I wanted to show. And that's still what I want to show. I, I want to show me in the trenches and just, and just the nitty gritty. Nothing fancy about it, right? Pull the curtains back and what, it, what does it really look like? That's what I still do, do to, to this day. That's why there ain't no fancy editing. It's just me clicking a damn button and going, you know, record on Zoom, right? That's all my damn YouTube videos are. And so back then it was the same thing on my cell phone, same thing, uploading videos here and there, maybe one a week, maybe, maybe, maybe a couple every couple weeks, like random, right? Random. That was 2017, 2018. Into 2019, I'm starting to see my subscribers grow. Like I'm going from a couple hundred subscribers to a few hundred subscribers um, into 2019. And I'm like, damn, dude, maybe what I'm talking about, maybe there are a few people out there that, 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 are, that are picking up what I'm dropping, right? Maybe there are a few people out there that are actually seeing what I'm seeing. And I already knew the industry. I already knew landing pages, sales funnels, online marketing. I already knew that was big because Russell Brunson, you know, and, and those gurus prior to me, Lit, lit the whole damn industry on fire. So I knew that that was a topic for people to be, you know, to be, to be, to be um, searching sales funnels, landing pages, click funnels, right? Cause, cause, cause a few years prior to that, that's when click funnels blew up. Right. And so I'm, as I'm coming in, I'm like, dude, okay. Although I might not be a click funnel user. And, and then I ended up coming across Kartra in 2018. I just started talking about that. And I started talking about how I'm building funnels. And this was 2018 into 2019 and just doing and, and starting to do screen shares and now starting to do tutorials and just teaching people what I'm freaking doing. Nothing fancy, man. Day in the life is what I would call it. Rants of an entrepreneur is what one of my playlists, you know, is labeled under. And so it wasn't until 2019 when I really kind of somewhat got the hang of it. I purchased a little random online course from one of my mentors back then little inexpensive course on how he built his YouTube channel. He had 60,000 subscribers. He was at about 7,000 a month in residual income from YouTube. And I'm like, damn, dude. And, and, and I've came across, and we've all come across channels that have 100,000, 
300,000 subscribers, a million subscribers. My little boy, dude, 12 years old, follows gamers that are at 3,000 subscribers or 3 million subscribers. So it's like we all see these big channels, right? But when I'm looking at, but when I was looking at my mentor back then, which was 2019, he only had, at that time, he had, you know what, to tell you the truth, at that time, he had, I think he had about, I think he had about 40,000 subscribers and he was showing his actual income of YouTube and he was at about seven, 8,000 a month. And I was like, that's kind of crazy. And then I purchased this little course from him and it's an old course. So you guys don't even need to worry about it. In fact, I'm going to tie a video at the end of this one. So stay till the end of this video. You're going to see a video come up of me walking Deborah through how I upload my videos, the tags, the description, the, um, the end screen, the freaking card. I have that video come up at the end. That's what I ended up learning from this very, you know, inexpensive course that I purchased, purchased in 2019. It was that stuff. So it wasn't until, 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 until maybe, maybe the mid of 2019 when I started doing that. So, so 2017, 2018 into the beginning of 2019, I had no idea about any of that tags, description, thumbnail, freaking consistency and putting up a video every week like i didn't know none of that 2017 2018 beginning to middle of 2019 in middle of, of 2019 is when i got this course and i started learning these basics is what i call them they're basics man basics watch watch the video at the end of this one the setup is basic but it was also the fact that i was inconsistent so it was in it was at that moment when I started learning all this stuff when I'm like, dude, and what he was teaching and what he was what he was actually, you know, showing from experience, he was like at 40, 50,000 subscribers at that point. Now he's a little higher, uh, but not even not even crazy higher. I think now he's like at 60,000. So it's not not that crazy high, but it is high, obviously. But um, it's not like he's in the hundreds of thousands, but again, it was his income that blew my mind. I'm like, wait a minute, dude. So you're telling me. And, and so he, what he taught he, is he was saying how he only uploaded one to two times a week. And, 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 and that was it. And I'm like, dude, wait a minute. So you're at that many subscribers. You have a $7,000 a month passive income from YouTube AdSense. And you did it one to two times a week. That's when you guys, I'm like, holy crap. Okay, so if you did that, what would happen if I did one a day? Like, what would happen if I uploaded one video per day? Okay, now again, not everyone has that kind of time. I get it. This, you know, this is not exactly a one minute job. Like, there, this is time consuming as well. But again, when you turn it into documentation, it doesn't take that much time. It's like, dude, this is stuff I'm already doing. That's what my whole channel was based on. It's stuff that I'm already doing. That's why I'm telling you. In my previous videos, I encourage you guys, take whatever you're doing, your passion, your experience, your knowledge, your business. If you're building a business, start talking about that and putting that content on YouTube. Because as I started really stepping it up and I'm, I'm like, okay, dude, if this guy did a couple of videos per week and he got to that number, I'm going to go on an experiment myself and I'm going to try to put one up every day. And so it wasn't until... So, 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 so let me, let me back up a little bit until I go into what I started doing. It was in, let's just say September, October, when I started doing a couple of week, right? And then, and then, and then I started, and, and then I got my first deposit, which I'm going to show you. I got my first YouTube deposit and I'm like, holy crap, dude. And I got a YouTube playlist here. So you go into my YouTube ad money playlist. I documented every video from the first deposit that I got. Okay. Every month, every 21st of the month, I'm dropping this video. This is the new 21st of the month. Now, you guys might be watching this at a different time of the day, different time of the month, but it, this is all about the 21st, this damn deposit. So it was, in, it, was in, it was in September, October when I started really paying attention and doing what this guy was telling me to do, right? And then I started seeing my, my, my subscribers increase even more. And then I hit the 1,000 subscribers. I hit the 4,000 watch hours, which are your requirements. You have to have 1,000 subscribers. You have to have 4,000 watch hours to become monetized. That happened for me in September of 2019. Okay, so into October, into November is when I got my first deposit. So November 21st is when I got my first YouTube deposit. And it was a few hundred bucks. And I was like, holy crap. Now, keep in mind, it was only a few hundred. I have a video on that. It was only a few hundred. And most people would be like, what the hell? You've been doing this for two years and you got a $300 monthly deposit and that shit fires you up. 
Yes, that fired me up because when that deposit hit, I didn't see 300 bucks. I saw 30,000. I saw passive income. I saw residual income. That's what I saw. And I'm like, wait a minute. So you're telling me that these guys are now paying me on videos I did a year ago? And, 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 if, and, and now that I have the little formula down, if I keep doing this, that income can keep growing. And that's a form of passive income. I'm like, shit, I'm all in. And so it was in December of 2019 when I said, okay, what I just learned from this mentor, he was doing a couple a week. What will happen if I do one per day? It was in December of 2019 when I dropped a video every day. And then after that, I ended up coming across another mentor and she was like, I did. And she was at more subscribers. I think she was like at, I think she was like at 70,000 subscribers. And she said that what really helped her is that she uploaded one every day for 90 days. And this was after I already did my 30 day blitz. My 30 day blitz was in December of 2019. I come across her information and she's like, I did one for 90 days. And I said, okay, shit. Let's go another, let's go, let's go 90 days. I was only going to do 30 days, right? December, 2019. But then when I saw her, I'm like, dude, okay, it's on game time. I'll take that challenge. So then I ended up going another 90 days. So now I went January, February, March, and I put up a video every day. In January, I missed a couple of days because I wasn't really planning on doing it every day um, at all until I came across her video, which was like probably like maybe, maybe, I don't know, maybe, maybe week two of January 2020. And I'm like, okay, shit, it's on. I'm gonna from this day on, I'm gonna I'm gonna put up one every day. And so I I finished January by putting up one every day for sure. Into February, every day. March, every day. April, every day. Okay. And I'm and, and so now I finished. January, February, March, but then I said, okay, so now I have a total of four months down a video every day. It was at the end of of March when I finished that, and then my subscribers really started to increase. I went from 1,000 to 1,200 to 1,500 to 1,600 to freaking today, we're at 2,000, um, a little over 2,000, right? Let me refresh this. Into April of 20, into April of 2020, I hit the 2,000 subs. So shout out to every single one of you, man. Shout out to every single one of you subscribers. You have no idea how much I appreciate you. I freaking pray for you. I literally pray for you guys every single day, man. Subscribe if you haven't, if you want some freaking prayers. I literally pray for these 2,000 people, 82, every day, man, because I don't take this lightly. I appreciate you. For you to, 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 to smash the subscribe button, That means a lot to me, man, because I I know how that is. I'm a freaking consumer. I don't just smash subscribe on everybody at all, right? If they have stuff I'm I'm interested in talking about, okay, I'll subscribe. But at the same time, I try to keep my attention very, very narrow and very focused. So I'm not subscribing to everybody either. So shout out to every single one of you who actually subscribe. You're for sure in my prayers. But that started happening. I broke the 2000 mark in April of 2020. And I'm like, damn, dude, maybe what I have been doing is working. Not only are people obviously feeling what I'm doing, but because of my consistency in the uploading, now I'm not saying you need to post every day. That wasn't really, most don't even do that. But I'm just on a mission. I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, I'm just a different character. I'm like, okay, if you guys did that and you see, you've seen success, what if I take it up a few notches? What will happen then? That's just how I am. That's how I look at everything, right? If we're, and, I, and that's how I'm teaching my little boy. 12 years old, he boxes. He's into football. He's into basketball. He's freaking, he reads books. Like the kid is a straight A student. I tell him all the time, like what I brainwash him with, I'm like, dude, if you see people that are reading a book for one hour, I need you reading it for three. If, you're, if your friends at, at, at boxing practice are practicing for one hour, I need you practicing for three, right? Like I'm just instilling this, this mindset where it's like, dude, that right there is what the, it, it, it gets you average. Like the average player is right there. I need you to be a little above average. And the only way we're going to be a, a little above average is if we do a little bit more. That's it. That's like, that's the only secret to success, man. If you're reading a book every month, I'm going to read one every week. That's it, dude. That's the only secret. If you're practicing in the gym for one hour, I'm going to be like Kobe Bryant and I'm going to practice for freaking eight. That's the only difference, man, between those who are successful and those, those who, who aren't. It's those little slight edge daily principles, those daily activities that get people ahead. That's it, man. So I'm like, dude, I brought the same mindset into YouTube. I'm like, dude, if these characters are doing it for freaking one a cup, one or two a week, I'm going to do one every day. And, and so at the end of March, when I finished that 90 day blitz, I went from December every day to January, February, March every day. I'm like, dude, screw it. I'm going to go the whole damn year. So then I ended up going all of April 
And that's where we're at right now. I completed a video every day for all of April, April, and I'm going to go every freaking day for the rest of the year. Because again, in my case, this isn't just a part-time thing for me anymore. This is literally what I do. I'm building my agency. I'm building my digital courses. I'm into affiliate marketing, which is not a ton of different products. I'll show you my affiliate you know, product. It's just random. It's Kartra. It's what I promote on my damn YouTube channel, every damn video. And then it's this, and then it's this YouTube income. I'm telling you, man, you want to keep it simple. You don't want to be doing a million things at once, but, but, but find what, where you, you know, really, you know, what jives you and what gets you going and, and, and start talking about that, man, and start documenting what you're doing. And so my whole mission in 2020 is to literally blow my channel up by uploading a video every single day. So this hasn't been an overnight thing. It has been a grind, but I'm telling you, man. The reason why I'm convinced that every single one of you need to be doing it, whether you're a consumer and you're just on social media to consume, that's one type of person. But if you're the, but if you're the other type of person where you're not just there to consume, but you're there to actually build something, whether you're a business owner or you're, an, you're, you're a quote unquote aspiring influencer and you're looking for thousands of followers on instagram you're looking for thousands of followers on tiktok you have intention behind that because you know what influencers are worth you know that these people have 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 pull when it comes to brand deals partnership deals and monetizing their influence right so whether you're that type of person or 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 or, or not i'm here to tell you right now man thank god i started putting this content on youtube in 2017 and not on these 50 other platforms like Gary Vaynerchuk always talks about. Shout out to Gary V, but it's like, shit, man, you want, us, you want us posting 50 million times on 50 million platforms when those 50 million platforms ain't paying me shit, right? Unless you're an influencer and now you're at 500,000 followers on Instagram, okay, maybe you might be getting some brand deals at this point. But what about in between? What about from, from, from 10,000 followers to 50,000 followers? Were you getting any money, right? So, so again, this content I could have put anywhere. Thank God I put it on YouTube because now every 21st of the month is freaking Christmas. Every 21st of the month, I get this email, okay? Check your recent payment. We, just, we, we, we sent a payment for your AdSense. This is a deposit, you guys, that is coming in every month, and it just started, right? So again, I'm t I, I give you the backstory. I give you, you know, my my the, just context ar around where I'm coming from to now show you the basic numbers. Okay, this money started coming in in November of 2019. Okay, so had I been more consistent in 2017, had I known what the hell I was doing in 2017. 2018 into 2019 this income would have been double okay but i don't cry over spilt milk i'm looking at everything forward from this point on it's freaking game time if these folks are going to start paying me every month why in the hell would i not turn up right why would i not turn up and and so thank god i'm turning up thank god we have this opportunity and that's why i'm saying as i mentioned in the beginning for millions and millions and millions of you out there that don't have a job today for millions of people that don't have their business open today. I'm telling you right now, you still have that message. You still have that same pitch. You still have that knowledge, that passion, that expertise. I'm encouraging you right now. Those same bullshit videos that you're putting out everywhere else, they need to come here. Okay. They need to come here. They need to come on YouTube, man, because I truly believe what I have created as far as this little income. Now it's not, we're not balling just yet, right? But I'm seeing already a comma. I'm gonna start seeing a comma. I'm already I'm already visualizing a comma. I'm already visualizing six figures a year. And again, even if it's not my full time hustle, which it really isn't, I'm just documenting my full time hustle. My full time hustle is clients and agency and digital courses and 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 that. All I'm doing here with YouTube is documenting that. That's all I'm doing, man. But at the same time, that knowledge is what most people can benefit as well from. And that's why you know two thousand people are here so far. So shout out to every single one of you. But again, the whole plan here now, had I known what I, knew, what I know today, that's what I'm telling you. I'm giving you my game right now. Had I known in 2017, 2018 that it's going to take the tags, the description, the end card, the, card, the end screen, the thumbnail, 
the, the, the consistency. Now, if you go, if you're not posting every day like me, no big deal. But what you want to do is you want to post at least weekly. That is the key is the consistency over everything else, your tags, your description, the thumbnail, all that stuff make, make plays a part as well, but it's the consistency. You have to stay consistent. So if I was consistent in 2017, 2018, the beginning and middle into 2019, this channel would be even way further, but it's all good. I know what it takes now because obviously you guys are finding me. Um, and, and now I'm seeing the income, even though we're still at a small income, I still see the power in that growing and growing fast and growing into the six figures. And I don't care who you are, man. I don't care how much money you think you have. Six figures, let's just call it 8,000 a month. If you built an extra income of 8,000 a month on the side of what you're already doing. I don't care who you are, who you are, that would change your life. In fact, in America alone, an extra $500 a month will change 95% of Americans would change their life financially. Just an extra 500 a month. That is a fact. So for those of you that are watching me in different countries, shout out to every single one of you. An extra 500 a month in the Philippines would have you living like a freaking king. An extra 500 a month in India would have you living like a freaking king. So it doesn't take that much money, man, when it comes to an extra income to change people's lives. That's why I'm on this rant. That's why I'm encouraging. That's why I'm convinced because although it's not five grand a month in extra income just yet, a few extra hundred, especially at times like this, which will save most people's asses. And that's what I know for a fact. So, and, and, and that's what fires me up. I'm fired up because I know you guys can do the same thing. I know you guys can get to, can, can surpass my channel. I know you have way more knowledge than I do. I know that you have way more other stuff and better stuff to talk about than I do. I know you probably have an idea that can, that can be exposed to a, an audience way bigger than what I'm going after, right? Which is the online entrepreneur. These cooking, you know, niches and health and wellness niches these are big, 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 big audiences, man. You guys, I mean, depend on what you're, what you're into. But at the same time, here's another fact. You don't need everyone. So you don't, even need, you don't even necessarily need to be in a crazy boom in industry or niche. You could talk about freaking sewing. You could talk about freaking building Legos. You could talk about freaking knitting. You could talk about landscaping. You could talk about gardening. You could talk, talk about freaking automotive and mechanics and how the hell to freaking change your oil in your car. You can literally be talking about anything and you will find your audience. And with that being said, you don't need everyone to, to like you at all. Again, man, at my small channel, I'm going to show you the income and what's starting to increase from it. It all started getting that deposit in November of 2019. And after that, it just kept increasing, kept increasing. It's, it's, it's going to continue to increase. And that's what fires me up. But even at my low numbers, man, I'm telling you, man, it's game changing. Financially, it is game changing to the average family's household income. Extra income can go a long way, man. So here's what's going on now. Okay. So again, shout out to every single one of you. This is an email that I get every 21st of the month and I've been getting it since November and it's like freaking Christmas to me. Okay. So where we're at now is 2082. Okay. Um, I put up a little over 450 videos. So again, this ain't for everyone because again, most of you are going to quit. Most of you are not going to be consistent. When I say put up three videos a week, most of you will do that for about a couple of weeks. 99% of you will stop. That's, that's just the fact. And that's the way it is in everything. I don't give a shit what it is. Going to a gym, freaking school, freaking diets, whatever, like everything. 90% of people out of 10, nine out of 10 give up no matter what. Right, so you have to be that one percent. You have to be that 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 one percent that that says, you know what, dude, I see what the hell he's doing. That shit ain't simple. I mean, that ain't hard. Like I could do the same damn thing. That's why when I learned when I learned from the first mentor, and he was teaching me, you know, how he got to forty, fifty thousand subscribers. I'm like, dude, that ain't hard. Like I can do that for sure. In fact, I could do more than that. I'll do one a damn day, and that was my whole mindset. And that's that, and that's the mission I've been on since December of 2019. Because again, man. This is my side hustle. This is my extra income, but I just see this income surpassing many other hustles that I could have started a long time ago. Okay. Again, with this same content, most of you are spraying it everywhere. 
I'm just telling you in 2020, let's narrow it in. Let's focus the attention and freaking park that content here because here's what the numbers are looking like. Okay. So let me, let me click on analytics. Let's go to revenue and let's click on April right now. We're in April. Okay. And this is where it all started. Okay. This is where it all started. It all started in November, getting that check for, for 312. In fact, I think, I think actually, you know what, in October, in October, in October, I ended up getting, actually, no, it was, it was October when the money was made. And then in November is when I got that October money. So October, let me, let me see if I can click see more. Cause I want to show you from, from that other angle, not from this angle. Cause this angle can get, can get confusing. Let me go back. Let me, um, let me see if I can see lifetime. So what happened in October was paid out in November. Okay. Let me, um, let me go back. Okay. Let me see if I can, if I can show lifetime, let's just, rather than going April, let's go lifetime because this is going to show me. Okay. So it only goes back down to, to, to November, but, but whatever happened in October was paid out in November and that was 291. So I have a video of that. November 2019, I'm doing a video and it's a 291 deposit, okay? In November, whatever you do in that month, it's paid out the following month. So December 21st, 2019, I'm doing a video about the 312, okay? So that's how it works. What happens in, in November is paid out in December. So, so I know the way it looks right here. It looks like 312 was paid out in November, but no, 312, that's what happened in November and you're paid out the following month, okay? So in November, 312 was generated. I got paid that in December. In December, 335 was generated. I got paid that in January and so on and so on. So 413, 494. So in March, 569 was generated. That is this email over here. So this email that I'm getting in April, that was from the income. That was 569 deposited in my bank account in April. Okay, what's happened so far in the month of April and we're not even done yet. We still got, and this 546, let me show you. Let's go back to April. So this right here, this is the daily incomes, right? These are the daily incomes. So again, man, I'm not lighting the world on fire, but at the same time, it's like shit, man, nor do I need to. This extra few hundred, dude, I'm telling you, it's going to be a few thousand in no time. And again, I don't care who you are. If you had 3,000 in extra income, passive residual income from videos you did a while back, and now you're getting paid a monthly income on them, you're telling me an extra 3,000 a month wouldn't change anyone's life? Like, are you freaking kidding me? Like, on top, like, like, right? I'm talking extra income, you guys. I'm not trying to convince you to go do this damn thing full time. Extra. The content that you're already spraying against the wall on social media, Park it here, okay? And, and again, what I've done in this a period of time, I'm convinced that you can do it faster. I'm convinced that your message is probably way even better. That's what I'm convinced on. That's what this is all about, is that what I've done here, I know you guys can lap me in no time, okay? So if I look at April, so far, this isn't counting. We're at April 24th. So this is not counting the 23rd. So it's a day behind, right? So, so far, we're at 546 and it hasn't counted yesterday. So we're, we, let, so let's count yesterday. So the 23rd, right? So I got to count. So that 546 is not counting the 23rd. Okay. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight more days. So if we're averaging, let's just call it 25 bucks. Now, again, there's some that's at 19. Okay, I'm going to call it, I'm going to call it 20 bucks. Let's call it 20 bucks. There's eight more days. There's eight more days. If we just average 20 bucks a day, that's 160. So 160 plus the 564, we'll finish this month for sure at 720. Let's just call it over 700. So, so this April, we'll finish at over 700, which I'll get paid on the 21st of May. Again, I don't give a damn who you guys are, man, and how much money you think you have. You're telling me an extra 700 a month 
wouldn't help. And I'm not telling you to take hours a day doing this crap. I'm telling you, take what content you're putting out already. That same cute video that you're trying to do on Instagram live when no one cares. That same video you're doing on Facebook live. It blows my mind. Real estate agents. Yes, I'm talking to you. Local business owners. I'm talking to you. You got 3,000 friends on your personal Facebook page. 99% of them live across the country. A real estate agent is going Facebook Live talking about their listing in their backyard when 99% of their Facebook friends live across the country. All I'm saying is that same video, first of all, it should have been a Facebook ad targeting that local area. So any of you local business owners that are doing these Facebook Lives, Instagram Lives, Instagram stories and thinking that that's actually doing anything. It's not. Now, if you're getting deals out of it, okay, well then I'll, let me just bite my tongue and swallow my words. I'm just convinced because I've spoken to thousands of you guys since 2016, since building my agency. I'm convinced that most of you are not. So 99% of you, all that content isn't doing anything for you because you're not running Facebook ads. You're not targeting your local area. That's number one. But all I'm saying also is that same content, that same damn video you did, park it over here. Because what started happening, let's just call it from October of 2019, November, December, now we're into 2020, January, February, March, April, six months, six months of me actually knowing what I'm doing, tagging, end screen, car, card, freaking thumbnail, description, consistency. Okay. So all that stuff matters, but it's the consistency. And again, if you're not going to do it every day, like I've been on a mission to do it every damn day since December, then I'm telling you consistently upload at least two to three videos a week. If you can do two to three videos a week consistently, why don't you stick with one number? Either, either you're going to, you're going to do two every week or you're going to do three every week. That's what I want to challenge you on. If you can do, let's call it three. If you can do three videos per week, for a six month period, I think you'd be further, further than where I'm at. So that April income, by the time we're done with April, that will be over 700 based on just basic math, right? If I average $20 a day, which, which all of mine are over 20, I'm seeing 25 a day. I'm seeing 30 bucks a day. If we just average 20 for the rest of the month, that's going to put us at over 700. That's a video that you'll see in May. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll see where that number is at. For all I know, shit can hit the fan and freaking YouTube freaking collapses. I don't know, shit. But we're at, where we're at this second, I'm freaking grateful. I'm grateful, I'm humbled, and I'm just convinced that all of you guys can do the same damn thing. And at, at the times that we're in right now of this uncertainty, these uncertain times when it comes to our economy in this country, even around the world, shit, people are hurting financially, man. I'm encouraging you to start doing something different. That same crap we're putting all over social media, park it here, man. And keep it simple too. Pick a topic. That's what's super important as well. Don't start talking about all kinds of random stuff. Pick a topic. So I'm just assuming that most, most of you guys that are actually watching this video. You guys are aspiring online entrepreneurs. You're either some type of business owner trying to figure out how the hell do I build a landing page? How do I run Facebook ads? How do I get better at social media marketing? Majority of you, actually shit, I would think all of you that are watching this right now are into that. So, so, so that's my topic, right? That's what I built my channel around is, is that. But, but rather than having to think of random stuff all the time to talk about, I just simply document what I'm doing, experiences that I'm seeing, right? That's my channel. So, so whatever the hell you're, you're fired up on, keep it that simple. You don't need to know all about editing. You don't have to have a crazy intro. You don't have to do all this other fancy, smashy stuff like on, that you see YouTubers have. Like you'll get there eventually. I'm sure I'll get there eventually. But right now, shit, man. I'm freaking, I'm, I'm grateful for the over 700 that I'm going to see in May, in May, in June, we're going to be over 900 in July. We're going to be over, over, over a thousand in extra income, passive income. And I talk about this all the time when it comes to real estate, it's like, dude, I come from real estate. I come from mortgages and banking. It's like, dude, today, most passive income type of opportunities have been in real estate. I go purchase a property. I'm an investor. I go purchase a property. I, 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 I finance it through a bank. Now I have a monthly mortgage. My monthly mortgage is $2,000 a month. I rent it to the neighbor for $2,500 a month. And I have a monthly positive cash flow of 500 
that has been where residual income, passive income, that is, has been for the last hundred plus years, that has been where the term came from, real estate passive income, being an investor, and having this monthly cash flow. Do you understand how much that takes? Like, do you know, do you know, do you know how much money you need? Like this whole 100% financing is gone. You need to come with money now. You need to come with 20%, 25%, 30% down, or you better be coming with cash to purchase a property, to rent it out, to have a few hundred a month in positive cash flow. It's like, who the hell wants to do that nowadays? When I can come over here, and create a passive income on these videos that ain't costing me shit. And the responsibility and the liability and the overhead ain't there like it would be in real estate. That's why I love Grant Cardone because he's not teaching that headache. He's teaching apartments. He's teaching, no, don't, don't go out there and invest in one door. Go out there and invest in freaking 900 apartments, right? So that whole passive income experience with, with single family residential homes, has where, has been where everybody has been glued on thinking that they that 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 that's, that that's the only way to make a passive income or maybe the stock market you go and invest in some stocks and and you get a dividend how's that going for you bro like right so it's like dude there's not too many opportunities there's not too many income opportunities where we can actually build a passive income i'm here to tell you man this is my passive income that I've been able to build. And I don't see 546, I actually see 5,400. And I don't see a full-time income, nor do I need to see a full-time income. I ain't no YouTuber. I see a part-time income. And I see a part-time income that is actually more than most people's full-time income. So in closing, I'm blessed for every single one of you guys, man. Every single one of you that actually have the nerve to smash subscribe. I'm thankful for you. You're in my prayers and I don't take that lightly. Don't take that lightly. I don't just say that to freaking say that. I'm telling you, man, I'm on my knees every freaking day sending a shout out to you guys. So if you haven't subscribed, man, subscribe. Smash the bell for notifications. Drop me a comment below. My name is David. I'm out here in San Diego building a social media agency and a digital publishing company. Now I'm taking the knowledge and the skills that I've been doing for other people. I'm packaging it all up in video form and selling it in a digital course. That's what I'm fired up about. And now I have a new passion and a new fire in me to build a YouTube channel. Not to be this crazy YouTuber, but to build an extra income for my family and I. That's what fires me up, right? Because I know an extra income like this goes a long way, a long ways in times like this. And I truly could, I'm truly convinced, man, that it will do the same for you and your family as well, man. So shout out to every single one of you. That income is going to continue to grow because I'm going to continue to grow and I'm not going to stop, man. So if you're new, drop me a comment. Let me know where you guys are coming from. Let me know what, what type of business you're building online and let me know how I can bring value to what you got going on. Um, that's pretty much what I wanted to share with you guys, man. Um, that right there is, is a big deal, you guys. That's a big deal. Um, don't think you need to reinvent the wheel. Don't think you need to go out there and, and be some creator. Just document, man. Document what you're doing. Um, and I'm telling you, as you put that content out on YouTube, you will find your tribe. You will find your audience. You will find those that, that, that get glued to your channel and, 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 and really find value in it. And, and as I was trying to say earlier, look, at this low subscriber count, that ain't nothing, man. You guys are following people that, that, that have 20,000, 200,000. Some of you follow YouTubers that have 2 million. Those are real YouTubers, right? Even at my small number, man, I'm telling you, a few a week consistently, that's the key. You have to upload consistently. You guys can surpass that in a few months. But I'm just so grateful and I'm, and I'm so, um, I, keep, I hate to keep using the word convinced, but I'm convinced that you don't need everyone at all. Based on these small numbers, this extra income is a big deal, okay? And I'm telling you, it's only going to keep going up. It's only going to keep going up, and I know it could do the same thing for you. All right, guys, so I appreciate your time, man. Thank you for joining me. God bless every single one of you out there, every single one of you going through some crap. I'm telling you, man, when you go through hell, don't stop. Keep going, okay? Because you will see the light at the end of the tunnel. You will see the bright out of out of the dark you will see it man it will it will be there but you you just can't give up man you just can't keep give up you got to keep going keep going and and fight for what you know is right all right guys so i'll see you in the next video get that money over now